Hey, Kate Brodick, welcome back to Morning Live in person. Yes. Oh my gosh, we've been talking to you for Oh, well, two years on Skype. It is, and it's actually, it feels better to be in person and not on a screen. No kidding. It's so nice to have you here, and welcome to our new studios, yes, by the way. Yes, it's beautiful. I love Thank it. You. Thank you. And congratulations on your new office yes, opening we, today. Yes, we are so excited. Um, so we have our second team office. It's the first one to open, though, and uh, located at 76 Kent Street South in Simcoe, the original post office. Oh, yeah. Uh, we've completely renovated it, and we are celebrating our big grand opening tonight, and we are just so excited. Okay, fantastic. So, uh, what time do we show up? Five to seven. Five to seven. Ribbon cutting at six. Okay, so. refreshments? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. But uh, the Cape Brodick team with Revel is. Uh, your catchment area is? Uh, Brantford, Brant County, and Norfolk, but we're really excited to come into Norfolk. I yeah. do have agents and team members who live there, and so to sell in their own uh, area is just uh, is just really exciting for them. Yeah, and so here we are. The market has cooled. It we're has. Uh, into a buyer's market now, yes. but that presents some uh, unique advantages for Norfolk. It does. It, you know what? Norfolk is just such a beautiful area where it's surrounded by ports and beaches and lots of land, and it's still really accessible for those people coming from like the Hamilton area or Brantford and Brant County and even the GTA to get affordable housing and a much bigger home and a much bigger piece of land. So you're getting people, younger people looking for affordable housing, but I would imagine a uh, very popular retirement spot. Absolutely, like yeah. things like Port Dover, Port, yeah. Port Rowan. I mean, those are great areas that uh, people are coming from, you know, within a half an hour to an hour driving distance to settle down and, and cash out on their big home and settle into a nice quiet community. Yeah, that's the thing. And I'm sure there's some appeal there too because with the market cooling and people seeing the value in their own homes decline but they can take advantage of that lower pricing going out of market like Norfolk. That's right and yeah. it's all relative right? Yeah, exactly. It's yeah. all relative everyone's so concerned about the sale of their home but they're not buying at inflated prices. Right you're buying lower. So. That's exactly right and now the due diligence is coming back. Yeah home inspections? Uh, absolutely and that adds uh, confidence to buyers now yeah. and before you know when we had the the market back in the winter the bidding wars, you know, the emotional bidding and the no conditions, that was not leaving buyers feeling good about the transaction and now now they can they can come in with confidence yeah that yeah not knowing what they're getting but also buying at an inflated price that's exactly right yeah, yeah. Um, now the price what's the average price in Norfolk just over 750,000 but we have to keep in mind with that 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 also includes larger parcels of land so you know in Brantford and Brant County you do tend to get um, a lower average price when you only think of those new construction homes and homes in the north end that average price now in Norfolk is considering like more um, more acreage, so mm -hmm. bigger lots. Right, and, and again, another advantage. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, uh, so uh, what tips do you have uh, for uh, buyers coming into the market? With the current climate well you know what everyone is so nervous because they don't seem to have a lot of confidence because we've seen this steady decline speak to your real estate professional talk to them about your concerns weigh out the pros and cons of the new mortgage interest rates that have increased with their mortgage professional and just lead with confidence and know what you what you want and look for it now is the time to buy i mean everyone's waiting for prices to continue to drop but at some point you have to really think about the advantage of a lower interest rate versus a higher one right yeah you know, and uh, the interest rates are, are are where they're at now battling inflation but they are now's the time as far as like you know the value of homes and the price of the drop That's now do right. you see this cooling has it leveled off now will there be a further cooling or or will people who took a pause during the crazy pricing jump back in now and elevate prices. I think if we see another increase in September, we may see prices drop slightly more, but I do think we're gonna start to see more people coming into the market as it stabilizes and buyers get more confidence. Mm -hmm. So I think that uh, by the fall, we, we might see a, a much better market. Okay, and you might see some morning live viewers of the big grand opening. That's right, I hope so. <laughs> okay, and uh, more details on that. We're going to link up all your socials at chh.com yes. and more on the Cape product team. Thanks for joining us. Good to see you in person. Good to see you too, Bob. We'll see you after this break.